order Nyan Nyan pancakes. Let's focus on the photo. I'm a detective. <laughs> Let's order some pancakes, okay? Let's just get the most out of this visit. Because I, for one, personally, me, you know, I, Lambda Delta, Robin, I would love to visit Japan and get into one of these made cafes. So I'll do it by proxy with Ito experiencing it. Okay, okay. I'll have to, um, let's see here. The Nyan Pan Nyan Cakes and the Pretty, Pretty Kit, oh fuck, Pretty Kitty. Oh shit, I just got it, Pretty Kitty. <laughs> that's a fuck, that's a fucking good one, that's better than Nyan Pan Nyan Cakes. Pretty Kitty, get it? Fucking hell. Oh, excellent choice, I, I mean, Nyan, those are very popular items. Those are a very popular item on our menu. What the fuck is this supposed to be? I mean, that, that's the face, but but what's this? Someone tell me, please. Right, so I ordered. That means I can finally ask you about this. No, no, you, you haven't ordered a communication package, you know? Before your order arrives, you must further do do the ultra secret Nyan Pan fan cheer? Tee hee! Nyan Pan. What, what? Do I have to? <laughs> Come on, surely I don't need to do something silly like that. <laughs> but I must insist, I am in Nyan. One can taste the love cooked into the Nyan Pan Nyan cakes unless it's released by the Nyan Pan fan cheer. Man, she's retarded, isn't she? I know it's all an act. I know they're acting. I know it's all all in the package, you know. When you get to a place like this, that's the full package you get. And it's an authentic experience and I would probably love it in real life. Let's be honest. But right now it's fucking up my voice and getting annoying. Ah, oh, fine. You win. What do you want me to do? Excel... Excelient mistress. That's a fucking word. Already, I can feel the love pouring from your kind heart. Let's begin. Please place your paws into the air like this. Oh jeez, she, she even does it. <laughs> like this. Perfect, Ayaminian. Are you sure you have done this before? Now, you must repeat these sacred verses. Nyan Melo, Nyan Palo, Nyan Walla Paw. Oh, she's blushing. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh god. I would love to be there right now. What? Nyan Melo? Nyan Palo? Nyan Walla? Po? Um, Nyan? Come on. Nyan Melo. It's not that hard. Nyan Melo, Nyan Palo, Nyan Walla? Po, I think. Uh uh. Don't forget to raise your paws. Nyan Mello, Nyan Palo, Nyan Walla, huh? Unbelievable! The passion, the vigor! I can feel the love pouring out into the room, I am in Nyan! She kinda went overboard on the smiley there. You know, I can't lie, I do feel like a bit of my negativity just flew out of me. Now that I've said the cheer, can we. Oh my goodness, Mistress Tanyan! Your pancakes have arrived! That was so quick! Hold on, you didn't tell me the Nyan Pan Nyan cakes were shaped like little cats! Oh yes, they are painstakingly made with love by our staff! Staff, sorry. Not staff. <laughs> this little whipped cream tail! It's so cute! Ah. Oh. Nyan, now. Ayami Nyan was saying something about the pictures I recall. No, no, not now. I'm eating now. Come on. Hold up. No need to rush things. We can't talk on an empty stomach, right? I knew this would happen. <laughs> I knew this would happen. <laughs> oh, mmm. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, fuck. Oh, she. Indeed. <laughs> now I know where the Steam picture comes from. Oh, fuck, yes. I hope you're enjoying the thumbnails I'm, I'm making for this game. I'm thoroughly enjoying making them. There are some amazing pictures in this game. Does your maid staff actually make these? Because they were amazing. Of course, I am Inyan. And now that you've 
Eaton, I'd be happy to answer any questions you have. Oh, I can't keep up the voice, sorry. Oh, right, Dad. Have you ever seen the girl in this photo? Let me see. Mm, yeah. Whoa, are you alright? <laughs> I am concentrating to my fullest, I am Inyan. Oh, but this young mistress is not familiar to me, Nya. Ah, oh, I see. Well, thanks anyway. How much do I owe you now? That dress is so pretty. It looks like it was a custom made. I've seen some of that quality before, Nya. Oh yeah, where? This is a possible lead. Maybe you should ask the collector. Hmm. The collector. She's a fashion dis- wait, what? She's a fashion designer in Akihabara who designs costumes for the maids and idols who don't have a big budget. Collector, huh? How can I find her? Supposedly, she has a shop on this very street. Oh wow, what a fucking coincidence, isn't this? Supposedly? She's a very mysterious lady, I am in Yan. My co-worker Mina and Yan has met her. Her shift starts soon. You should ask her about it. Oh, not another cat lady, for fuck's sake. Come on. I will, thanks. Oh, and, um... Next time? Can I get a picture of the pancakes? I ate them so quickly that I forgot. Of course, I am in Yan. Yes. Arigatou gozaimasu. Uh... Okay, so there's no option to wait, so I guess we just exit. Maybe come back here later. Look at the menu. 2,500 yen for a parfait. Suppose in a maid cafe, you're not only paying for the food, but for the gods to wait on your hand and foot like a lord. Hmm, not really my thing. Um, If I'm correct with my... Exchange rate, which I'm not sure I am, so correct me if I'm wrong. This would be about 20 to 25 euros, so um, 25 dollars maybe or 18 pounds. <laughs> oh my god, I hope that's all right. And I'm not just talking out of my ass here, <laughs> anyway. We're looking for the collector now, and to be honest, the collector came out twice now. And this here could very well fit also into some collector-like thing, right? Joshi Kosei, or JK for short. Why fantasize, uh, fantasize about a high school student when you can pay money to date them for real? Does anyone actually believe it's all innocent? Is this real? Oh, is this a cafe where you can... So you, you pay money and you go on a date with a high school student? Is this real? Can you really do that? I mean, just asking for a friend here. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> okay, I've, I've looked at him already. Maybe I want to talk to him now? No? Okay. Um, yeah, that's... I did that as well, so I guess I try to go up here. Wait, what's this? Ah, tiny ramen shops like this one bring me back. When I was a student, I used to go to a ramen shop to get a bowl once a week. It was my own private little ritual. Okay, Ayami, thanks for letting us know. Every time the automatic door opens. Uh, oh, sorry, every time the automatic doors open, the noise from the pachinko parlor... Oh, fuck, we've read that one already. Let's enter. Wow. The fucking music. I don't know how this game can keep surprising me with its characters, music, art, everything. Just the gameplay is a little stale, maybe, but man... It's better than a than a regular visual novel, I think. It's a little bit more more clicking. Hi, sorry to bother you. I'm Ayami, what's your name? Oh my god, she has very big eyes. Hmm, I'm Moika. 
whatever you want, make it quick. I'm kind of waiting for someone, so... Alright, I'll cut to the chase. Can you tell me anything about this photo? Oh, what decade is that dress from? Wait, glow sticks? Uh-uh, this is some idle thing, is it? If you're from some modeling agency or whatever, I'll tell you right now, there's no way I'll wear that kind of gothic lolita stuff. No, nothing like that. I'm an investigator of sorts. I'm less interested in the fashion and more about the girl herself. How should I know? Idle stuff is so boring. Hey, are you like the investigators on TV? Did that girl cheat with some guy's wife or something? That's so exciting. N know what you should do? You should totally ask the collector about that photo. What kind of collector? No, the collector. It's like a name he gives himself. Guy knows everything there is to know around here. Wait, wasn't the cat collector? Am I am I mixing things up now? Wasn't the cat collector a girl? A woman? Or oh, have I misread that? Maybe. My friend Akan Akane told me about it. If that girl's in Akihabara, I bet he knows about it. Why? Is this guy an expert on idols or something? No, weren't you listening? Like I said, he knows everything. Which shops are employing foreigners illegally? Who is behind the, on the rent? Hell, he even knows which capsule machines have the rarest stuff. At least that's what I heard. No offense, but why would some high school girl need information like that? Well, that's... it's complicated. Akane works around here part-time and there was a customer who used to come in and kind of obsess over her, you know? A real creep. Before long, he was following her home. Oh my god, please don't... please don't let this get dark. She complained, but her boss wouldn't believe her, so Akane asked the collector to give her something to make the weirdo go away. And did he? Sure did. He gave her a photo of the guy that she mailed to the creep's wife. Let's just say it was incriminating. What did he get out of it, this collector? Why don't you ask Akane yourself? She's out with someone right now, but should be back any minute. Great, another woman voice for me to think of. Not like this one wasn't bad enough. I mean, she kind of sounds like me just being a bit more feminine. <laughs> Thanks, Moika. I might just do that. But I love her name, Moika. Moe. So, um, again, no option to wait, so I guess I'll just ask her about the collector again. Like I said, I don't really know much. As Akane, she'll be back soon. Okay, so another thing to wait for. No one seemed to know anything about Reina, but every time I brought her up, I heard the same name over and over. The Collector. It was the only clue I had, and I knew that if I was going to get any further in the case, that was the thread I'd need to follow. Um... Good, so we... Can we now enter the maid cafe again, maybe? And talk to this girl who's supposedly... Met the Collector? Hi, I'm Inyan. Back so soon? Hi, is Mina Nyan back yet? I was hoping to ask her about the dressmaker you mentioned earlier. Oh, well, she's here, but, well, the thing is, I don't think she'll be able to talk. Something powerful has happened. It's really bad. What the fuck is this? What? what uh? This can't be a real... No. I know Japanese letters. This isn't a real Japanese letter, is it? How bad are we talking? Monumentally, horrifically terrible Ayami Chintnyan. The perfect storm of soul crushing existential dread. I bet there was more than one pun in there. Come on. Well, could have been at least. Um, can I help? Oh, Ayami Nyan is so kind hearted. Maybe she'll talk to you. Wait here one moment, please. Ah, oh, fuck me. Oh, uh, hi, um, Nia. You alright? I heard something bad happened. Maybe I can help you? <laughs> I don't think I can even talk about it. Every time I think about him, I just want to go into the back and cry. Try and relax. I'm a police officer. I'm sure I can figure out a way to make this better. Oh, that's the first time I mentioned this since I'm in Akihabara. 
Japanese? Well, I it's Samuel. Samuel? Who is he? A distant relation of yours? A boyfriend? Did he hurt you? Run out with your money? Samuel Cuddlesworth, my best friend. He's missing. Samuel Cuddlesworth. Okay. I think I see what's happening here. What the fuck was the name of Ito's cat again? It was something similar, right? It was not Mr. Whiskers. <laughs> something else, but whenever I think of cats, I think of Mr. Whiskers. Her ultra rare, one of a kind kitty plush mistress, I am in yet? These things don't grow on trees, you know? <sighs> a teddy bear. Okay, it's not even a real fucking cat. You lost a teddy bear. A plush. Samuel Cuddlesworth was not a teddy bear. He was an ultra rare cat plush. Oh, cruel world. The hideousness of the cosmos laid bare before my very eyes. Why did you think you'd understand? I'm sorry, why did I think you'd understand? No one understands. I'm all alone. We're all alone. And then we die. <laughs> Aw, poor Mina. Oh, I hate seeing her like this. I don't think she'll be of much use to society until she finds a replacement for her beloved Cuddlesworth. Okay, so... Our plan now is to go back to Moeka. Ask Moeka where we can get a Mr. Cuddlesworth replacement. Try to get a Mr. Cuddlesworth replacement. Go back here and get this information. And of course, Moeka will only help us after we've helped her. So there will be a side quest inside the side quest. Man, maybe I've played too many RPGs or something. Thank you for listening, Ayaminya. While you're here, want some pancakes? Um. Insist on information. I'll find you a plush. Or pancakes. I'll find you a fucking plush. God damn it. For fuck's sake. Huh. Listen, I can't promise you as rare of a um, plush as Samuel Cuddle Snipe. No, his name wasn't Cuddle Snipe. But I'll find you something, alright? Cuddle Swerve. Samuel Cuddle Swerve. The second. Twice removed, actually. <laughs> Fuck me. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> oh, I don't know why. I really got professionalism out of that. I would have expected the hands on approach, you know, the give me this information now to be more professional, but. And wait a second. Can you see this? Isn't this Moeka? Let's get to her. Come on. Oh wow. She's looking nice. Um, ask girls about collector. Hello again. This must be the friend I heard about. Akane, right? Uh, yeah, but if you'd open your eyes for literally two seconds, you see we're a little busy right now. Go away. Wow. Oh. She's sobbing. Fuck, there was the option to play this thing here earlier, but I guess now I have to push for information or ask what's wrong, but as I said, it's a side quest within a side quest, or I guess two separate quests, whatever. Ask what's wrong. What's wrong? Oh god, her fucking voice. I don't know you. What do you care? If you tell me what happened, maybe I can help. She's fine. One of her customers is an asshole, that's all. Oh, she's in one of the things I've, I've read about earlier, right? The high school cafe. Customer? Don't look at her like that. It's not what you think. I work at one of the JK cafe cafes around here. They want high school girls in uniform to serve food and play games and stuff. Nothing weird. Yeah, not weird at all, for fuck's sake. Not weird at all. Usually, the customers want to hold my hand or pretend to be my teacher. Sometimes they buy me things. It's harmless. It's not harmless. It doesn't bother you that these customers who want to hold your hand are mostly middle-aged men? Hey, you don't know her. Don't act all high and mighty just because you're older. It's better than walking in some shitty restaurant or at a convenience store. Is it though? Fine, you're right. I can't judge you, but obviously something isn't working out if she's crying like that. I already told you, one of her clients is an asshole. Akane, right? Why don't you tell me what happened? I don't get him. 
He was nice to me, but then I said I would go into this dirty sewer with him and he snapped. He threatened me and told me I was an ugly little girl. Wait a second, dirty sewer? Wait, Becca, did you say he tried to get you into a sewer? <laughs> I know this guy. Oh yes, he's just a fat, disgusting old brother. I never want to see him again. Oh, oh yes, flex muscles. We can do this. He was so nice before and would hold my hand, say how pretty I was. Why would he say all those things? Fat old pervert who goes into sewers. Yep, there's no doubt about it. This client of yours. I know him. He kinda sounds like Geralt. <laughs> you know, Geralt of Rivia, the Witcher. I know him. <laughs> you know him? Make him stay away from Akane. In fact, make him stay the hell out of Akihabara. Yeah, this is our turf. Before you said you wanted to know about the Collector, right? How about this? You make it so me and Akane never have to see his fat, four-eyed, perfect face again, and we'll tell you everything you want to know. Well, do we have a deal? Um... Deal! Fucking deal. If we're dealing with who I think we are, then I'll be more than happy to help out. Really? Thank you. I, um, I think I heard him say he was heading to a club in... Club? Sorry, not club. Club in Shinjuku before he left for the train station. Fuck me, so I have to go to Shinjuku now to do this quest? Fuck that. 